Good morning. Good morning. Okay, let's go put it in mommy's toilet. Woke her up early so that she wouldn't go potty in her bed, but she went um, potty in her pull-up. Luckily, it didn't leak this time. But anyway, I saw this segment from CNBC when I had that luxury spa day, and it was hilarious. Hey, help! Okay, I thought you said you were going to do it yourself. Now you need help. Yay, perfect! <laughs> now it is perfect. Anyway, it was really funny and it was spot on and I read the article hey, that Jarrett wrote. I'll have a link down below of this segment if you want to see it. I'll also put a little snippet. When was the last time I took a nap? Oh my gosh. Did you hit your sister? No. Yes, you did. You go on timeout. No crying. I almost feel guilty having that just me time. If you want to see the full video, I'll put a link down below. It's, like I said, it's really comical. I don't know where Minnie Mouse is. We have to go find her. Up. Mm hmm. Down. Trees. What's that tree? It is the tree. And they're out. Oh, there's so many stuff here. There's many stuff. Okay, what do you see? Look, mommy, it's in your ring. It is like mommy's ring. Look, that's mom. It's my bed. Mm-hmm. It's my bed. It's with my bed. What else do you see? I see horn. With the with eyes time. Mm-hmm. With eyes time. They play mm -hmm. that horn in Little Einstein? Yeah. <laughs> bet. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Mm. We're having breakfast, and Kira's just rocking out. No, sit down. Ow! Sit. <laughs> Whoa! She even slowed down for the part where I held it out. Happy oh. birthday to you. <laughs> Val's birthday. Can you give her a birthday kiss? <laughs> well, I figured this is the only time we're all together in the morning, so. Oh, yeah, good idea. <laughs> she just picked up that little piece. I know. She's really good with her fork. <laughs> Next chopsticks. What? I'm doing my Good job, Kira! I think she literally just discovered how to use a fork. Wow, major feels right there. I just can't get over that. That's so because funny. She starts with her arms crossed and finishes with her. <laughs> <laughs> I'm already feeling a sugar high, which I don't know. Now I'm like, was it a good idea to have cake first thing in the morning? 
That's okay. It's not often that it's somebody's birthday, wow, so. Wow, a nice job. Sorry. So I was cleaning up one of the drawers and I found my MAC Spice Lip Liner. I've been looking for this forever! The girls are out for a walk and it's YouTube day and of course laundry. Literally every single day. I know I tell you guys but like I'm not even kidding you. There's a load every day. Time to get myself ready. It's already past 11. Makeup and hair done. I'm gonna see if I could fit into one of my favorite dresses of all time. This one. This is a free people dress I got about four years ago. I just love the style of it. I love the quality of it. It's like, is it a wool? Oh my gosh, did I just say wool? I meant linen. It is about 50% uh, linen and it's so comfortable. And to me, this is like the perfect summer outfit. Oh, I wore this at the, um, when we were doing our house tour a year and a half ago or so. It has lasted so many years and so many washes and look there's even beads on it and it's amazing. It's free people. I bought this off of um I think it was from Holt Look forever ago or maybe it was from Karma Loop. I just want to wear a dress today because it's so nice and lately I've just been wearing like sweatpants and like workout tops so. Alright so it fits. It's just too tight. Yeah, this It looks like I'm pregnant. Oh my gosh I am not wearing this. <laughs> Aww, looks like I'm pregnant. So bummed out. That's okay, this is motivation. I like keeping my clothes, my old clothes, because, well, especially for one, if I like it, but even if it's still too small on me, I'm keeping it. <laughs> do you guys do that too? <sighs> Dang it. This one is cute. It fits. I just look like I'm trying to be 17. So <laughs> we're going to go with just a regular plain black maxi dress. Juliana is psychic. I asked, it's so crazy. Okay, okay, I know, you could get some grapes too. I asked Juliana, hey, guess what daddy got for you? And she said, grapes? She knew. So we're munching on green grapes. So, they're so healthy. They are so healthy. Can I have they're some so toast? sweet, mommy, they're so sweet. Sweet and healthy. Auntie Mel, would you like some grapes? Did you drop your bow again? No. Where did it go? I don't know. Okay, so you dropped it. So I don't need it, Mom. Okay. Whoa. Could you imagine how different it would like to be if it was just like this? <laughs> like peaceful? Oh, it would be different. Auntie Val and Kira is chasing the ice cream man down right now. <laughs> I don't know. I Hopefully they caught them. Oh. Oh. What? That's the first? You ever heard of those? I've never. How much are they? An extra one. They were only a dollar. It literally tastes like cotton candy. Oh, have you guys tried the cotton candy grapes? No, you told no. me about them. Yes, they sell them at Walmart. Cotton candy you know candy they have grapes. apples mm -hmm. that taste like grapes now? Oh, what? Grapes. So I like guess they're like apple okay, grapes or something. Oh my There's god. Apples that taste nice like grapes. Job, girl. I was like, that doesn't sound right. That's <laughs> weird. <laughs> What's the point? It's like, just eat a grape. <laughs> Unless you like the crunch of an apple. Yeah, it's like the crunch of an apple with the taste of yeah. yeah. these All these fruit days, hybrids. With me mess. Oh, that was so exciting. <laughs> I just like how they don't choke on them anymore. Mm. Like, they're old enough to. Understand, chew eat the it. whole thing. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you. And she's gonna also do. A, <laughs> she's so big. So I'm just about done editing my video. This isn't really a makeup tutorial, but it's a video showing how I get glammed up. But anyways, that video will be up on its Judy time uh, by the time you watch this. I wanted to clarify something because I've been getting lots of messages and tweets from people talking about vlogger fair. I will not be attending vlogger fair this year. To be honest, I was really surprised that they put my name on the confirmation when they never confirmed with me that I would be there. So, oh, I'm running out of breath. So unfortunately, I will not be there, but Benji will be there. He's going to vlogger fair and um, yeah, I guess that's all I have to say about that. <laughs> Mommy. Yes, baby, I'm your mommy. mommy. <laughs> this is the sweetest thing ever. I was just trying to go pee. We're literally talking in bed, and my lash is literally is like hanging off like this. It's so so I, I just got up to look in the mirror, and I'm like, 
Hello, my lashes and off. And I even complimented you on how beautiful you look. No, you said your hair is so beautiful, but no, why? But before that, I how did you not beautiful. call me out on my lash? I saw hanging, but I thought that was like <laughs> a trend. Are you kidding? I thought no. I split the no. flare out like that. You do that way too many times. Like sometimes I'll have lipstick on my teeth or like something on my cheek and he never says anything. If we don't mention it, we're in trouble. But if we point out something wrong, then we're in trouble. No, so guess like what? I would appreciate too. it because, hey, if we okay, were can out... Can you show your attitude right now? I'm appreciating it. Yes, it's like that because you didn't tell me any good friend would tell their friend, hey, you got I, lipstick on your teeth. You didn't even mention that I told you you were beautiful today. That's and no, I that's you fine. Had the most... And he said I had nice hair, but you could just do me a favor. If you had a big white stain on your black shirt, <laughs> why would Ooh. there be white stain? But anyway, what I'm saying is, if you were to go out in public and you had this huge white stain on your black shirt, I would have been like, hey honey, you got a white stain. You should probably change your shirt. It's my dad's birthday today. So we're heading to my dad's favorite <sighs> restaurant. He loves Chinese food. If he could eat Chinese food every day, he would. And I already know what he would want. He'd want like the house noodles, house special noodles. Crispy. But it has to be crispy. And I'm not talking about like this short little crispy, like real Chinese crispy noodles. And he likes wonton soup. I was thinking and about recommending a new place I found out about. It's more authentic. It's like where the is most, it at? It's called Panda Express. <laughs> Best General Tao. I actually love Panda Express. <laughs> I really like their food. Last time I went to Panda Express was like at the mall, maybe 10 years ago or something. It was so long ago. But yeah, I do miss Panda Express. It's super authentic. they're all front facing. Every time Juliana watches a movie up there, the girls like tilt their heads so high and it feels so bad for them. I think it will just help in general with car sickness. Happy birthday, nice haircut. Thank you. Do you want to eat it? Do you want to eat it? Let me do. I can't wait to eat it. Well, let's eat it. I say cheese. Whoa, those fishes are fast. So dad, how old are you now? So it's 16. Oh wow. <laughs> so that makes me like negative 40. <laughs> but it was really hot. <laughs> Hi. Hi, fish. Hi, fishers. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, fish. One, yeah. two, three, cheese. Cheese. Let me 
me smell Ew, your teeth. I, I fart down for no. I know, he's right behind you. Let Go me ahead. smell your teeth. Wow, did you floss too? <laughs> yeah, she did. You know what? She still have to go pee pee though. Okay. Oh, go get your friends. Oh, They're right there. <laughs> I had such an amazing dinner with my parents. It's always great having my parents. Because, you know, I always hang out with my mom and not often with my dad because he's always working. And even when I was younger, I wasn't around my dad a lot because he was in the Navy and always traveling. And, like, we would even move state to state. But... Um, yeah, he was, like, overseas a lot, so, uh, I don't have, like, the closest relationship with my dad, but, you know, I still love him and I respect him. Anyways, comment of the day is from Charmaine de la Gente. Judy, please do a tutorial or at least show the products you use in your trying to look sexy for hubby vlog. Can't stop thinking about how glam you looked, especially curious about what's, what's on your cheeks. Thanks and much love to you and the family. Thank you so much. Well, the video that I just posted up on is Judy Time is that look. I am wearing lots of makeup like I did the contour and I did the hair extensions and everything. But I talk about every single product that I use and I already posted a link down below. Alright guys, I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Bye!